Hey everybody! Today, the day I'm filming this is Thursday, October 8th, and I got a new toy in the mail yesterday. So the new addition to the personal arsenal is the JHS 3 Series Reverb Pedal. I've always been curious about JHS and a $99 price range series. It's a great place to start. And I was faced with a choice and I went with the pedal type I don't have. So now suddenly I have a reverb pedal. You want to hear this thing. You don't want to listen to me talk. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start it with all three knobs at 12 o'clock. And I'm just going to play for a bit. The guitar I'm using is a 2014 Gibson SGJ. The amp is a Roland Cube. And the microphone is an SM57. <laughs> Oh, there's also a pre-delay switch on this. Let's turn that on. Okay, let's back that off a bit, right? Put that back at 12. Turn the EQ all the way down.
so far. Awesome. I like this thing. I've never really thought much of use for reverb pedals. I tend to prefer to leave reverb in post, but it's a nice little tool to have. And especially with the range in reverb tones you can get off of this thing, you can get, you know, nice echoey room to just like cathedral just on this tiny little pedal. What's also impressive, I looked this up uh, on Sweetwater. This is, I don't think it's the cheapest reverb pedal you could buy new on Sweetwater, but it's like the second cheapest. So you get a ton of bang for the buck because usually reverb pedals are more expensive than this guy. I like it so far. I'll probably use it on solos and if I have the urge to get more shoegazy. Yeah, we're going to use this guy. All right, so that's going to do it for us today. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what you saw, you know what to do. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you soon.